I had always told students that, you know what, if you want to lead, you want to have that opportunity to make a difference in your community, um, then be ready to step up when needed. We have a ton of different groups and organizations that students can belong to, but one that has absolutely stood the test of time is our Mixed Roots organization. Um, I joined because a lot of my friends were in it. I heard it was really interesting, and like it like, ties into like cultural backgrounds. I joined Mixed Roots because I knew that it would be like a safe space for people of all ethnicities. I've met so many different kinds of people, like so many different personalities. I think that's really like what Mixed Roots is is making new connections and really gaining that experience. This is a group of students that comes together to celebrate the diversity that we have within our school, making sure that we look at that as something that is to be honored. And that's truly what uh, my honor is here today, is that I get to serve as principal of this wonderful high school, bringing students together, um, get to you know offer those diplomas to them, and over $400,000 worth of scholarships that students were presented with tonight. I'm South Sudanese, and so is my mom. My whole family is. I'm kind of on top of the world because I got to like get this award through like such an amazing club, like Mixed Roots. So I'm going to UW Madison next fall. My family, being an immigrant family, we don't have like that much money saved away for college. So I'm so happy to be able to use this money to help me fund my education. My family, we are Hmong. Not a lot of people heard that. Yeah, we're kind of like not known to the world, but honestly, I didn't, I didn't think I'd get it. It was honestly a surprise. I was like, let's go. <laughs> you could put your, your skills and talents yes. in the So once I get into Duluth, my major will be business management. I planned paying off college or my student debt, obviously, because I know that's going to be big bucks. <laughs> I love like psychology and like helping others. I really want to do that. There needs to be more color in that area because there really isn't and I'm so excited to be that oh my people. <laughs> in about 1995, Holly came into my office dealing with diversity in uh, our school, which we weren't very diverse at the time in comparison to now. And uh, from there, uh, yeah, mixed roots at Oatana Senior High School uh, developed and in over 25 years, and it's still in operation today. I'm, I'm happy about that. I think how marvelous, you know, that people continue to work to bring a welcoming attitude to people who are coming into the halls of Oatana High School. I'm as pleased as punch to be asked to be come back and uh, to be involved in the, the, the process of recognition of mixed roots and the process of recognizing uh, students for their work within the whole idea of cultural change and what, we, what that means to us. Our commitment has always been to uh, make sure that our community understands that we are greater because of our differences. And that's really where Mixed Roots has um, been, um, with Holly coming back uh, and others uh, saying, you know what, this is a continued celebration. Once a Husky, always a Husky. Uh, once you've uh, been a part of the Oatana High School, uh, we're going to continue to celebrate that.